These are the barbecue. Oh, look at that. Sweet, dark, deep colour. Wow, just look at that. You got a lot going on just there. <laughs> look at this, man. It's like two of these is equal my head. Can you see that? <laughs> what? just happened oh my god what just happened and we got this smash burger i think this is what we should kind of like benchmark them for kind of <laughs> you get that crumbly luxurious butter like beef that just melts in your mouth that is a munch Ooh, we've dropped it we've dropped it Yes, boys and girls, ladies and gentlemen, welcome to a brand new episode of Halal Munchies. So today is a very interesting one because I'm at a place called Burger Lab Manchester and I'm in their studio room. So they have a studio room, which is amazing. But the whole kind of block around me is all dark kitchens. There's so many dark kitchens around me, different cuisines, and different types of uh, food being served within this building. So I'm kind of in dreamland right now. I really am in dreamland. Let's give you a little shot. They've even got a ring light for me, which is quite nice. So um, I said to them, do you have a place I can uh, record? And they said, unfortunately not. We are a dark kitchen, but we have a studio room. So I'm excited. I've got all the food in front of me right now. I've just opened my fast and I cannot wait to tuck in. I think when it comes to Manchester, I think this will be a fantastic starting point. Because I have done quite a few smash burgers in Manchester, the playlist will be the link in the description below. You may or may not have noticed that I have now moved to Manchester, so I'm no longer living in Birmingham. I do go back actually quite a bit, but I'm living in Manchester, so I'm gonna really explore the food that's in Manchester. So what do Burger Lab do? They actually specialize in lab boxes. So they're combo boxes, a few different burgers in there, a few wings, loaded fries, um, some salad, some sauces, all that good jazz. So I've got quite a few things in front of me. I've got some wings, I've got some katsu burgers. I just want to show you and start eating. But I'm extremely hungry. Manchester, let's see what your food is like. So guys, look at all the food that's come and I cannot wait to tuck in. Where should I zoom in first? Let's zoom into this one. So this is the combo lab box, or, sorry, lab combo box. First of all, you've got your loaded fries. You've got your spicy biology burger, so the spicy chicken burger. You've got your barbecue wings just there, and you've got your classic smash burger just there. I think this is what we're really gonna focus on. This is their staple. This is what they're known for. We've got a Dexter. Oh my God, that's a messy one. And then you've got mac and cheese on there. You've got chicken fillet um, deep fried. Oh, it looks crispy. And then you've got your uh, smash burger just there. So a lot going on in that one. Then you have, uh, this looks like a habanero. Here we go, habanero wings. And look at this one, this one really surprised me. Katsu, katsu loaded fries. I love katsu me, but let's check out what Burger Lab is like. I don't know where to start. I've got the box in front of me, but I've also got the Dexter in front of me. But I feel like I should start with the box because that's the right thing to do. So Dexter, with the mac and cheese, we're gonna move you over to the side. Start off light, let's start off light. Let's go for the loaded fries. Ooh, I can see fried chicken with some sauces and some mayo. And oh my God, look at that, that's a big bite. Here you go, smell that. Oh, it's a messy one. Those sauces are incredibly creamy. Oh my God, it's playing around on the walls of my mouth. The chicken is juicy, really, really juicy chicken. And if it's not juicy enough, you got the sauce to get the moisture levels up. Really, really like that. So they are skin on fries too. Mmm, they're cooked perfectly. Mm. It is a massive portion, an absolute massive portion. Mmm. Ah, oh, so cheesy, so creamy, so saucy. I look, oh, those are delicious, man. Those are very close for me to drop. That is a munch. Very close, borderline but I would highly recommend them. Now moving on, we've got the smash burger thing. This is what we should kind of like benchmark them for, kind of, this is their standard. This is what they're known for, burger lab. And then you've got, oh, you got gherkins. Can you see the onion just there? A heart-shaped onion. Oh, how lovely. I love you too. I love you too. And then two smash burgers, lettuce and some cheese sauce. <laughs> oh my God. You get that crumbly, luxurious butter like beef that just melts in your mouth. You got a nice sauce in there, you got a crunch from the lettuce and the onions and the gherkins give it that 
Pungent kick. I am loving that one. Ooh, I was close to drop it again. I was very close to drop. That is a munch again. Very, very close. Spicy biology, I think. It's called the spicy biology. And look at the size of that big burger. Oh my god. Um, let's see what you got in there. Let's let's open the lid. You got cheese, you got cheese, you got sauce, Algerian sauce, I think. And you got a crispy chicken patty. It's supposed to be a spicy one. But um, here we go. Mmm. Mmm. Oh my god. Oh my god. Mmm. That is delicious. Let's give you a zoom up on that as I talk through it. So, very, very juicy chicken. Very juicy chicken. Uh, a little bit less spice. It's not as spicy as I thought it was going to be. It's quite light on the spice. I'd say it's like a 6 out of 10 for spice. Nice brioche bun. Lovely cheese sauce that binds it together. But yeah, guys, uh, those are three brilliant burgers. Every single one of them I'd highly recommend. Really, really tasty. We're going to see where my hand goes and it's going to a barbecue wing. So, here we go. It's deep fried and the sauce is lathered on. Um, here we go. Mmm. Yeah, those are really good. Yeah, I'm just nibbling away. So first, you're welcome with that spicy and sweet barbecue sauce. But I think it's a good balance. So a lot of barbecue sauces I've had, they're quite overwhelming. However, this one has got the perfect balance. Unbelievable, perfect balance when it comes to the kind of sweetness level, balance of flavors. There we go. We always reference the balance of flavors. So they've got it spot on. I love the inconsistencies because some part of it's kind of like, soggy some parts is really crunchy and then you get the juicy chicken so you, the textures in your mouth are crazy you're getting a bit of sogginess you're getting a bit of crunchiness you're getting a bit of juiciness that's what you want man, with the wing that's what you want speaking of wings let's go for one of these habanero wings oh yeah oh yeah oh this is a dark deep smell i'm smelling you can definitely tell it's a spicier one here we go <laughs> again oh oh there's a spice kick. There's a spice kick. We don't mess about. We gotta clean it clean off the bone. Those wings, they're spicy. They give you like a little kick from like the back of your tongue. So like, oh, that is, that is got a bit of a kick to it. So I like it. It's not overwhelmingly spicy. Guys, just a quick one whilst you're watching this video. I hope you're enjoying this video. Be sure to like. Give me a like right now. I would really, really appreciate it because it essentially it really kind of promotes the YouTube video so a lot of people on YouTube can see this video. And also, if you consider subscribing, I'd really, really appreciate it if you could subscribe. And of course, share the video around. Um, I've just jumped onto TikTok and I'm kind of using it frequently now throughout Ramadan. And yeah, I'm really enjoying TikTok, so follow the TikTok at Halal Munchies Reviews. We're gonna move on. Oh, I'm looking at you. That's who I'm looking at. I'm looking at the Katsu Loaded Fries. I go, hello, hello, look at that, man, oh my god, I cannot wait to talk into that. I love katsu in general, the Japanese sauce. We are going to get a bit of a chicken, we're going to get some of the fries. Oh, it's got that traditional Japanese flavour. Here we go. Oh my god. Mmm. I definitely think this isn't everyone's cup of tea. However, I think, because I like katsu curry so much, this is definitely my cup of tea. It's a very unique flavor. You wouldn't really associate it with a burger place. And I love that it's different. I love that they do something like this. So you can see just there, that kind of thick, creamy katsu curry sauce, beautifully garnished with a bit of coriander. And it slides to perfection and it's incredibly juicy. So guys, whilst you're there, I've also got the two sauces they do. One's definitely like a cheese sauce. Oh, look at that, cheese sauce. Oh, that cheese sauce, natural cheese sauce, oh my god, that is delicious. I could literally drink this, oh my god. Let's get a zoom up on this, I don't know how much you're going to see of that. Oh, look at that, can you see? It's so, so runny. Oh, look at that. I thought originally this was um, Algerian sauce, but no, it's actually a unique sauce. I've got to find out what it is. So let's get a chip and let's dunk it into there. Yeah. Mm. It hasn't got the pickles and the onions that an Algerian sauce has. The cheese sauce that you see right now, here, that is a munch. Get that. 100% recommend that sauce. Okay, we're going to attack the Dexter. This is the beast. This is probably the biggest burger they do. Uh, they probably do bigger if you recommend or suggest that they do. I don't think you should recommend or suggest that they do. 
but <laughs> look at this man it's like two of these is equal my head can you see that uh <laughs> it's just looking at me oh my god look at that it's like i can see everything that's going on there i can see the crispy edges that the smash burger has i can see the crispy chicken fillet i can see the mac and cheese i can see the cheese i can see the brioche bun the lettuce all the sauces ah here we go <laughs> i'm gonna do this <laughs> what just happened oh my god what just happened i thought the textures couldn't get any crazier but they definitely have you're eating a burger as you do oh i can taste the chicken i can taste the seasoning on the chicken which is brilliant by the way really really nice it, it gives it that kind of you get a spice kick you get a kind of pepper kick too then you get the cayenne and then you go on to a journey where they introduce you to the smash burger and you eat the smash burger and you're like oh i've already had this it's buttery it's crumbly it's luxurious oh i like this then the mac and cheese comes and you're like whoa then you get that kind of like you know the texture that pasta has that kind of squidgy pasta taste uh, and then you get the cheese that coats like the palate of your mouth so like your tongue is like scraping it out from the left and the right side of the roofs and the walls of your mouth it definitely is getting a recommend from me and guys it's ramadan so make sure you keep hydrated maybe not coke <laughs> but definitely the water so guys, overall I've had a delicious meal here at Burger Lab Manchester. I think again, this is a great addition to the whole kind of burger scene in Manchester. So uh, look at that. I'm in the ghost kitchen just now. So it's quite nice that I'm in the unit where all this amazing food is being pushed out. The highlight has to be that cheese sauce and that smash burger, definitely. I think anywhere I go, I have to get the kind of basics and understand what the foundations are of an establishment. Everything else was really delicious. I actually liked everything, which is interesting. The katsu was really good. I wanna give a highlight and a shout out to the katsu. If you love katsu, you will love that one. Guys, it would be amazing if you could give this video a thumbs up. It really helps share the video around YouTube. Please, please give it a thumbs up. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Follow the Instagram page at Halal Munchies Reviews, and I'll catch you guys in the next episode of Halal Munchies.